Oh, snap. Let's see here. Uh, awesome sauce video here. And it looks like we're recording. So my, uh, awesome sauce video appeared for everybody. Okay. Hi, it's Kyle and his coin collecting again. I went bankroll searching today. This right here. That is what is opened up from $24 worth of nickels. Okay. That would be 12 rolls. 12 rolls of nickels. Here are some of the wrappers. And I also purchased $45 worth of dimes. $45 worth of dimes. These have not been opened. The reason why I didn't Man. open these is because... Spent a lot of money back of in the day. Rolls, I believe it's a 2010 <laughs> edition of the dimes. All brilliant, uncirculated, gem quality. Gem 2010s. Quality. Probably should have kept those gem quality, uncirculated rolls. I probably should have kept those. all these here, and I know that for a fact, is because every single end of these rolls, both sides, contains a brilliant, uncirculated 2010 dime. Back this to the nickels. My first video Over here ever of coins are my nickel finds on my movie camera. An average so, day. It's kind of like testing it Some out. Some usuals like 1952. <laughs> yeah. Wow. There you go, 1952. Oh my gosh, I actually Pretty collected. Nice. Yeah, look back. That kind of coin in yeah. that rough condition. Awesome. Upgrade this one the, the range of uh, very fine condition. So very fine one. condition. Mm hmm. This it's one here's little... another 1952. This one is Gosh. a little bit weaker in grade. Wouldn't keep back. Here we go. This one's just a little weaker in grade, but <laughs> 1952. Oh man. This one oh, is gosh. also a Philadelphia strike. No mint mark. Oh, that's toast. That coin Almost is toast. the same grade. Here we have a 1957. What well, with a Denver mint mark? That coin is like way older than I am. Look at that mint mark. It's like half a century there old. Go, 1957. Old piece. Denver mint mark. This one is also in the grade. What the heck's wrong with my finger on there? Very fine condition. That's when I had like a psoriasis yeah, or something. It's weird. Like my finger is like peeling. That was ooh, this one here really weird. It's also found today in a roll of nickels. 1958. Focus. 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 Oh, yes. Go, Thank you. Thank you very much. And this one has a temperament mark. Yeah, it's not too bad. This one is probably wouldn't keep it now, though. extra fine plus. Probably extra fine 45, maybe even AU condition. What the condition. heck is extra fine AU50, plus? Perhaps. Extra fine plus. I have to take a better look at this little. That's when a person here. doesn't know an absolute grade on something. Then, they'll call it extra fine plus. We have another coin. But I don't Another do that Jefferson anymore. Nickel. I'm a lot better at that. And here we Rating are. my coins. Eh. 1961. Possibly uh, in AU no. condition. I could tell it on Possibly how long AU could condition. Hmm. Could be in AU condition. Cool. That one's a Philadelphia strike. No mint mark. If I recall, we've got and something. And I came across. Good. Very nice. Very, very it's nice. It's been a long time. 19. Gosh, this video is over five years old. This 1947. This from the grade of uh, VF30, something VF30? like that. Perhaps okay. VF30 for very that's fine not, condition. It's not bad, I guess. And not it too has bad. a San Francisco mint mark. Oh, now that. Actually the mint mark. That's a nice piece. Nearly yeah, anything with an S mint mark, I still want to keep it. I like San Francisco mint marks. There you go. Totally. There's the S mint mark right there. Side Monticello. Grade that one, like I said, and grade of very fine. Yeah. Eh. That's right. 30 or Pop something it on in like there. that. So it's in the very fine range. And we have a 1959 from the 1959. Denver mint. <laughs> yeah, right there. Let me get a closer look. Let me get a closer look at that coin. 
1959. This one, I'm not quite Ooh. sure if I'm going to keep this one, though. Yeah, they're that coin. Kind of worn I out. don't really know where my really jewelers loot is. I should have used that. Valuable videos. dates or so. Yeah. I just treat as normal pocket change. See, right there, that is yeah. what so I'm talking about. D. Sometimes not old coins date, but still nice are date. just that. They're just old, and they don't have any value. Then we have a 1946. The condition is not high enough, so... This 1946 I got a lot here. better at that in these, uh, in these videos I used to make. Yeah, I used to be really... Like, I collect them all! Catch them there all! Yeah! 1946. Get all of them! 1956? Also in... Uh, let, me, let me think. Oh! VG8. Probably VF VG20 10. or maybe something like that. It's not the best Oh, come on! Are you VG. serious? It's a Philadelphia strike, so... Why the heck would I grade that on VF20? Overgrade. Uh-uh! Uh, overgrade. Last but not least. After looking... At through nickel rolls and finding these mm -hmm. finds for today. I came Those across them today. The question hey, there's piece my metal detector. Of the day. Ah, my old white The question piece of MXT. the day appears yeah. to be some kind of uh, there, casino I token. That. I still have that coin. Dated that one right there, that is. Yeah, I still and have that coin. If anyone knows what this might be, you could just let me know. Yeah, hey, I can tell you what it is. I know what that is. <laughs> On the top here, it has the word token and evil. Okay. It's a token. And 19... the date, 1982. 82. And on the back, 1982. Mm. we have a slot That's machine. That's where Disco died. 1982. Disco. With these died. words. 1982. Above mm. the slot machine here. <laughs> what else? Right there. It's very unusual words. Derek Enterpreneto something it says on the, on the and piece. And the coin it's is made of nickel. <sighs> which I find to be very hey, at least it's made of nickel. It spends. Nickel. It spends like a nickel. Alloy. Sounds like a nickel. Feels like a nickel. And if anyone knows what this nickel. Be, just let me know. It's just not American nickel. And that is the mystery or, or find of whatever. <laughs> and I hope you enjoyed this video. I did enjoy your video, and Kyle. Oh, it, was, it was great. more wonderful finds in my bankroll searching. Thank you very much, and thanks for watching. Man, so unsure of myself back then. Gosh. Well, at least I snap. Well, everyone, I hope that was a entertaining clip into one of my very first YouTube videos that I made about coin collecting. Coin collecting. So, anyway, I will be making more videos like this, most likely, because I've got my new webcam recorder for my screen is called oh what's it called it's got a very unique name oh my gosh I'm gonna scroll down the page here uh, no that's not gonna help it's called screencastify screencastify is what I'm using and it's so far it looks like it's gonna do a good job as for recording audio I'm not sure how the audio is working but I'm about to find out. So thanks for watching everyone this new video. I'll be making some more, so stay tuned for those. And thanks for watching everyone. And as always, have a nice day and happy coin, coin collecting. See you later. Bye for now.